Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Monkey K here. Today, we got some Elder Scrolls Online gameplay. Now, in this one, um, there's a lot of new stuff that I've got, uh, including add-ons. And we're honestly, we're just going to start off with the quests um, just right now. So, let me just tell you something really quick, guys. Now, I am Veteran Rank 1. I did grind for a very long time, and I finally got there. I'm Veteran Rank 1, which is absolutely awesome. Which that means now we can either 1 or A, I guess. Uh, keep on doing all the quests in this land or b we can just um do the main quest and keep on doing the main quest until we get into Cyrdo or not Cyrdo what am i talking about until we get into like cold harbor and on to the veteran rank maps i guess so um i think we're gonna have to do option b but for now we're just gonna do the main quest that we can do so you guys might know we have a mini map over um, when you're seeing it, it'll probably, I don't know, top left corner, uh, there's a mini map, which is pretty dang helpful, it is a add-on, like, like what I said, I guess, and so that is the first one that is a little bit changed, now this one, is the second one that's changed, it's like a grid, like, system of your inventory, which is pretty sweet, um, now there's this, like, squares and like that, I'm pretty sure means it's more money, that is deconstruction, but I can't honestly remember what all these little squares mean. I know they mean something, but I really, I just don't know. I can't seem to figure it out. So, <laughs> that is that. Magicka, we leveled that up all the way. I think we did get quite a bit of stuff with um, our healing. Now, I'm pretty sure you guys did see we do the restoration staff. Now, basically our restoration staff is our main one. Because now basically all we do keep on doing the crystal blast crystal blast crystal bass blast i guess and when we get low we pull out the healing ward which is basically just a shield that at first i i'm warded all right i didn't ward it i um i morphed it to where it heals me at the beginning of when it starts and then after the six seconds it he heals me again which is pretty sweet this one literally just gives me six thousand health over 16 seconds which is pretty awesome then we have the blessing of restoration which is actually, let me show you, this is probably one of the easiest ones and one of the ones I you might see me do a lot. You just use your staff and it's like a little wall, but it, it, be, it like heals like, it heals two and a half thousand health, which is really, really good. Now you can see, I only have 10,000 health, so that does quite a bit. So if I just bam, bam, bam. Now this thing is also really, really good. Um, it's called Quick Siphon. You, I, 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 I no, I keep on trying to say morphed it. I morphed it <laughs> into where it just like casts instantly because it used to be like a one and a half second cast, but now it's just instant. Now, what this does is I put it on an enemy, and every time I attack them, it heals me, which is really really cool. And I thought that was pretty dang, pretty dang awesome. Now I'm trying to think if we did anything else. I don't think we did. We got a lot of passives, like a lot of passives. Pretty sure you saw all those. Werewolf level, fully maxed out, basically. Um, we can bite other people, which is awesome. Um, this one, I don't really think is really necessary. It's not that good, so I didn't bother using that at all. We got all the abilities for that. Um, Fighter's Guild, we got Imitating and Slayer. Mage's Guild, we already had passive and nothing else, I guess. Um, we, we did join the Undaunted, um, quest, or guild, I guess, which basically does, like, daily dungeons that you can do that gives you rewards, which is pretty cool. Um, didn't do anything in Assault Support, nothing in that, and Blacksmithing, we just, I think you've just seen everything else, so, yeah, that's pretty much everything else that's new. Uh, let me just get some of this materials. So, we got all that, and then the map has also changed, like, uh, I got an add-on that shows me all the Sky Shard locations and all of the lore book locations, which is pretty dang sweet. So, yeah, that's really all the updates, I think. Uh, and we are now, we are going to be, uh, whenever we find something that's better than this, we are going to be getting some different armor because this is a little bit low. It's eight levels below uh, what level I'm in. So, I think it's time for an upgrade. We also got a purple restoration or lightning staff and i think that's still the same so yeah that's basically all of the updates um 
I think I'm going to go empty my pack, so I'll see you when I'm done. All right, guys, so we are in the Mage's Guild talking to Danel Talano or something. We're talking to, to some dude or girl. I, I think it's a girl. We're going to talk to her. Uh, it said, I'm, I don't know if this is a Mage's Guild quest or an actual, like, main story quest. Because it says main story, but we're in the Mage's Guild. So I'm not sure what she's going to say, so let's just see what she has to say. About time you got here. Don't believe we've met. Name's Daria, but my friends call me Copper. I head up the Ring of Daggers, the King's Espionage Agency. You're looking for Von. I was told to report to you. I'll eat sand before I give orders to the King's right hand. You want to help Vonus with his crazy plan? Be my guest. I'll help him if I can. All right. So, what's the bet? A hundred gold says there's an attempt on our lives within the week. That's a sucker bet. Hidden armagers have hit us at least once a week for the past three months. All right. Hello, Venice. Let's see what you have to say, my friend. Thank you for coming so quickly, champion. I've been consulting with Countess Hakruba of the Fighters Guild. Both of our guilds believe the time has come to take the fight to Cold Harbor. But this places us in a delicate political position. What's the problem? Trust, as always. The Alliance leaders will never agree to join forces. And if our guilds only work with one alliance, the other two will see it as a betrayal. For both guilds, our neutrality is our strength. We can't afford to take- Is the situation really that dire? The war in Cyrodiil has been long and bloody, and all three alliances are spread thinly. They can't commit resources to an assault on Cold Harbor without making themselves vulnerable. I want to bring all three- What do you need from me, my friend? In a unique position. You could speak with authority, but you're not an alliance leader. You're respected. You have a reputation. They may let you get a word in before they leap at each other's throats. In short, you're the perfect diplomat. I'm going to speak with the alliance leaders. I found the perfect meeting place. A neutral location far from disputed territories. An island called Sturk. I can all right, I'll do my best. Okay. So it looks like we just got to go talk to all of the major, like... Uh, kings and queens so I guess we just got to talk to him and see if we can arrange the meeting so let's see what the king I think it's the king here let's see what the king will say aha Receive introduction. Ooh, what? This way? Oh, here he is. Yo. Greetings. And shatter you. Any questions? I didn't think so. Silence, Thrush. Master Galarian. My companion hopes to speak with you about the impending Cold Harbor crisis. I have heard tales of this one. The Skull King favors the bold, even among his enemies. Come, champion. Hold on. Um. We want this at full capacity. Stay your execution since you came all this way. So you guys can hear Choose it. <laughs> words carefully. I'm not a patient kid. Thank you for speaking with me. Yes, well, I am both suspicious and curious. If you are an assassin, though, get on with it. But remember this, you're coming to Southern Guard with me. You don't fear death? To fear death is to fear life. I am Nord. When my time comes, I will embrace it. Southern Guard will be glorious. No meetings, no schemes. It's time to take the offensive to Molog Ball. I propose a mood. All right. Let's talk to Van. Oh, crap. Oh, get healed, everyone. <laughs> that went well, I think. Shall we move on? Yeah, where to next? Elden Root. Okay, let's go to Elden Root. This was with my other red rank one guy. This was his like home planet, I guess home country maybe yeah i'm gonna go for home country <laughs> it's just home home country 
Oh, I guess almost home country. You know what? Just forget it. <laughs> forget what I said. I told in route if you could load, that'd be great. Absolutely fantastic. This guy's got some pretty rad armor. If only he had a super cool helmet. And make it 100% more better. What do you guys think about that Skull King's crown? It was pretty sweet. It was like a dragon. Like on both sides. And then like a circle in the middle. It was like that. It looked pretty cool. <laughs> Aha! Oh, receive an introduction. Yes, sir. Oh, is it Raz? Where's Raz? Razumdar! Ah, he was a sweet. He was awesome. I remember the patience and kindness you showed an awkward, freckled waif all those years ago on Fair Somerset. You captured this child's heart then, and it remains with you to this day. You warm an old man's heart, my queen. I remember well those halcyon days. As do I, my old friend. Sorry about Hello. those guards. I'm told they're necessary. These are dark days. A wise precaution, my queen. My counsel would be no different. If you'll permit it, my companion would like to speak with you. Ah, yes. Let me meet this hero I've heard so much about. It's not often the heroic deeds of one who by all rights should be considered a mortal enemy reach my ears. All right, Queen Irene, just shut up and let me talk to you. Jeez. Vanus is a dear man. In many ways, he is family to me. Since he has given you his trust, I'm willing to set aside our differences. But under different circumstances, you and I would be sworn enemies. My only sworn enemy is more like Ball, your majesty. Well spoken and point taken. To be perfectly honest, I couldn't pass up the opportunity. Oh, uh, you've heard you. of me? A true champion is like a stone cast upon the water. I'm humbled, history. your majesty. Kind of propose a meeting, blah, 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 blah. They're going to say yes, all right, all fantastic. Now we talk to him. Let's go back. All right, blah, 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 blah. La da 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 And then we'll head back to the Alliance capital. Maybe that's, um, or are we just going to, like, go... Go up to Kim Emmerich and be like, yo, 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 Kim Emmerich, you know I'm like your second in command, you know? So, like, come on with me to do this meeting to see if we can, uh, like, defeat, like, more like ball like. Like, yeah. Like. Hmm? <laughs> That's exactly what I'm gonna do. Uh, uh. Man, I really just want the last darn Mages Guild quest. I just want that Master Wizard, like, title, I guess that's what they're called. All right, let me see what time we're at. All right, guys, unfortunately, I think we're going to have to end it there. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up button and don't subscribe to my videos. Thanks. Peace out, guys.